Hello everyone and welcome back to Little Kitty Big City where we just unlocked the power to climb the vines. So that's really nice. <laughs> Although we're not very good at it yet so I don't think... Yeah you see we're actually uh, really bad at it. <laughs> <laughs> so we need to unlock more fish, well eat more fish, so we can get very strong. And for that I have a feeling we need- oh, some more shinies. Ah, hello there! Uh, hello? I wonder if you could provide me with some, uh, urgent assistance? Uh, I think that depends on the problem. Eh? Oh, I see. Quite right, quite right. I don't want to alarm anyone. Yes, it's rather a pressing concern. Although, perhaps I sh I'm just panicking. But there's no two ways about it. Uh, about what? Oh, didn't I say? It seems I have mislaid my ducklings. Mislaid? Is this a bird joke? I don't follow. <laughs> Never mind. Missing ducklings sounds pretty serious. It does, doesn't it? What happened? Well... We were all enjoying an educational tour of the neighborhood, me teaching the youngsters some local history, etc. And then what? For example, you know the robot statue in the park behind us? Uh... I didn't even know there was a robot statue there. Oh, you should absolutely visit it. You see, the robot is quite fascinating. Not a statue in tra the traditional sense either. Legend has it that a wise duck, not too dissimil dissimil dissimilar <laughs> from myself, in fact, would visit the park every now and then with his robot friend. Very loyal robot. Delightful. Back then, this was a lake. Hulking great wet things where the pair were, would swim, splashing and frolicking. You know, that sort of thing. But robots and water? Eh? Eh? All that fizzling and sputtering. No simpatio at all. Rust patches. Wet circuitry. Exploding knees. The robot, not the duck, I mean. Yeah, okay. <laughs> the robot's swimming days were over. Terribly sad stuff. So he asked the duck to change his programming. Quite the feat, if you ask me. Could never be get, in, get my head round computers myself. The duck helped programming, helped program the robot to wait in the playground while the duck swam. Grand idea that, and it went beautifully. But one fine day, probably much like this one, truth be told, the duck was attacked by a radioactive monster. Uh, wait, a monster? <laughs> a gecko. Usually, Gekko is our protector. You know, breathing fiber, saving orphans, charity galas, lovely chap. Apart from the rampages, really. Rampages? Oh yes, humans write those up in little paper documentaries. Very engaging, really. Paper document? You mean comics? So, Gekko kidnaps the duck and whoopsie daisy, throws him through a star portal. Whoops! Quack! Never to be seen again! And the, uh, the thing we missing, uh, we mistake for a statue in the playground is actually the royal robot waiting patiently for his friend to return from his swim. I, are you saying that Gecko has kidnapped your children? Or I'm not, I'm, I'm not seeing how this is related to the missing ducklings. <laughs> oh no, it's just a great story. I shared it with the ducklings before we split up to find more neighborhood stories for our own little show to tell session. Show and tell? That sounds fun. Eh? Oh yes, I thought so. Anyway, we scampered off in direction, different directions. All very exciting. All very exciting in the moment. But, uh, I suppose this is the crux of the matter. Really, I didn't see a time or place for so, uh, for us to reconvene. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. Wasn't sure what to do the best for the best. Not really a practical duck, you see. But I didn't understand. I didn't want us to be rushing around missing one another. Dreadful when that happens. So I retraced my steps back here and waited. 
No luck? Alas, no. But you seem like a practical sort of cat. Very resourceful. So could we team up? I'll keep watching. Watch here. Been kind of enjoying it, really. And you scout the city? The whole city? It seems pretty big. Hmm, you're right. There must be a way for us to narrow down our search. <laughs> yeah. We made a city map just last week. Marvelous thing. Part of our project to catalog all the different fish fish hotspots. The ducklings marked each of their favorite places on it. Such enthusiasm for maps. And I bet that's where they will have gone. Here, you take it. My orienting skills are dreadful. But you'll be able to track them down in no time. We got a map. <laughs> okay, a map made by the ducklings. It's really good. Uh, press M to view the map. I'm not so sure when it says it's really good. That makes me nervous. And just ignore the fish markers. I can't see what interest that would be to a kitty. Unless you're a budding... <laughs> oh no, not this word. Oh, um... It's shithalology. <laughs> it's... It's theologist. There we go. <laughs> of course. Oh, that that means people who study fish, I believe, or um, the ocean and such. I, I'm pretty sure. Anywho, uh, okay. So the map. Oh. Oh, whoa! We haven't even explored the whole map. That makes sense. Wow. Okay. Well, it's it is. Better than I expected, I must say. And there are three fish hotspots. So uh, those I do want to get checked out. Okay, let's see if we can find some fish, shall we? Wait, that one was shimmering. I thought there was just a shiny behind it, but apparently not. Oh, trash can. Gotta jump in this. <laughs> this is awesome. This is so cool. I, I I love rummaging through trash cans as a little cat. It really is... Oh, no! Oh, we almost got it. It seems apparently you can catch uh, birds when they're in the air, so I really wanted to try that. But let's collect all these shinies, at least the ones we can find. Oh, it's the... Is this the robot statue? I'm unsure. Seems pretty... Oh, there it is! There is the robot thatching. Oh, and there's a little area down here. Hello? Oh, a green one! We haven't seen a green one before. A cactus hat! The ideal, the ideal hat for when you need some personal space. Yeah, I'd say. Okay, let's crawl under here again. Gosh, that was, that was hidden, that one. I see windy fans. I'm wondering if there's a use to them. Okay, let's see. Um, Maybe we can swap hat. We have been wearing this hat for quite a while now. Um, I kind of like the corn hat. There's so many hats to get. <laughs> maybe we should wear a construction hat for now. That's kind of cute. Let's, let's do it. Oh, and there's a bone. Hey, 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 now. If there's a bone around, there should be a dog around. And if there's a dog around... Uh, Tanuki? Hello, test subject. Uh, esteemed lab assistant. I managed to get the pet work TM portals connected up properly. I can see that. Well, that was quick. I would have been... Uh, even quicker, but there was a minor space-time incident. Nothing to worry about, though. How minor? In the grand scheme of the multiverse, it was absolutely trivial. Just a tiny, teeny, tiny set of water pipe explosions that fell out of the future in the other universe and into the recent past of this un- Yes, I can see... I can see where all the water is coming from now. <laughs> Hang on a moment, is that where all this water came from? It turns out I've been using linear space-time when I should have been you should have used Crodric space-time. Laughable, really. 
You want to try it out? It's really cool. I just need to test up uh, a friend. That drastic space theme is safe now. Hmm. Um. Space time. <laughs> Test subject isn't filling me with confidence. That's why I pivoted flawlessly into saying friend. It still sounds risky. Yeah, but... Uh, uh, but risk is just a pessimist's uh, way of describing excitement. Anyway, if we get this working, you could use it to fast travel around the city. Uh, yeah, I, I guess. I kind of like running around, but yeah, sure, sign me up. Don't say no just yet. Hear me out. But I said yes. Firstly, there are... Wait, what? I said yes. For real? Call me curious. Yay, this is so exciting. You won't regret it. Do you need feathers again? Not this time. Your first journey was so short that I had leftovers. Hop in. It's going to work this time. I'm a hundred percent sure. Give or take. What? Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Where are we going now? Oh, you guys. <laughs> I'm not so sure about this one. Oh my gosh. No! It's you! You came back! I thought it scared you off when I jumped up at the window. That was you? Goodness me, you did give me quite a bit of fright. Sorry, sorry. I just, I get so excited when people come visit. You're a dog, right? Only the bestest dog, goodest <laughs> dog. <laughs> bestest, best, goodest dog. My human says so. Uh, well, it's nice to meet you properly. I didn't know there was a dog office. Official bestest dog title. Ah, you may know me by my other accolades. Uh, <laughs> Perhaps the squishiest, mushiest, the potato, or the fussiest, happiest little pooper. Um. <laughs> Wait, my owner told me that I was the squishiest, mushiest potato. Are you sure? Certain. I remember because she said it several times while smooshing my tummy with her nose. Gosh, that award must have multiple animals, uh, have multiple animal categories then. It's a pleasure to meet a fellow potato. Uh, likewise. Anyway, I, it was lovely to chat. I hope you have a good day. Um, don't go. There's this little thing. Can you help me, little potato? Uh, what do you need help with? I've lost my balls. Uh... <laughs> um... What? <laughs> my tennis balls are gone! You th Come through and I'll show you. Ah... Uh, I, I don't know. Maybe I should just... Okay. Oh. Okay, well, I'm not as strong as, as this guy is. Oh my gosh. Look! No balls! Um... I appreciate this might be a silly question, but aren't they behind you? Yeah, I, I see a couple balls over there. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, those? No, the... Oh my gosh, we were almost hit by bird poop. Those? No, these are my regular favorite tennis balls. I'm talking about my extra special favorite tennis balls. They're very different. Uh, what happened to them? Oh, well, you see, Tanuki built me a present. Ah, uh, let me guess. There was an incident of some sort. Not to start with. It was so cool. You could put tennis balls in and it, in and it would throw them for me while my owner was at work. Well, that sounds really nice. It was perfect for a while, but um, it also did go rogue one day. Balls everywhere! And then it caught on fire a tiny bit. I've got most of them back, but my three favorites are still missing. And the machine? I buried it. But please don't tell Tanuki. She would be so sad. Um, and also, please, 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 can you help me find my favorite balls? I'd be so grateful. Uh, sure, but how will I know that they're your favorites? Don't all tennis balls look the same? Absolutely not. Each one is subtly different from the other. Others, the scent, the taste, the texture, the personality. Uh, I'm not sure I'll be able to tell the pers favorites from non-favorites if that's the case. Well, 
My favorite balls also have bright rainbow colored stripes. Now that's a description I can work with. Shall I bring them here if I find them? Yes, please. Just put them in the hole in front of you, uh, in front of me, and I can guard them properly. Sure thing, big potato. You're the best little potato. Awesome. So we got a doggy friend. Cool. Oh, is this a little nap place? Awesome. <laughs> Cat napper. Oh, you guys, this is a little greenhouse. It's so beautiful. Okay, but I think I think uh, our cat now, whoop, is finished here. But look at this greenhouse. Oh, I couldn't possibly. I couldn't possibly. Oh, thank goodness. I can't. <laughs> okay, well, we've catnapped a couple places now. Uh, Tanuki, and this part is, uh, is on the pet park TM, but I need a feather to power it up. Got any? Uh, yeah, but I want to keep it right now. Okay. Okay, cool. Um. Oh, this is the garden. All the way back at the start. So... <laughs> There's another shiny bird. I wonder if we can catch it. Those shiny birds seem uh, seem pretty special. And there's water here now. <gasps> but now we can just climb up here. Oh, awesome! We're learning new tricks. I wonder. No, this seems to still be uh, too high up. That is unfortunate. Oh, there we go. Hmm. But this one, surely. I can't believe I forgot all about the fact that we could learn how to climb. And I was just sitting there wondering if maybe somehow we'd be able to learn it. <laughs> okay, well that's awesome. We do kind of need the map though here. Because I want to get some fish. Um, so that we can get better at climbing. So let's run past here. Also, we can always catch a bird on the way here. Here we go. <laughs> to get a little feather. There we go. And we release it. And we have a feather! <laughs> we actually have three of them now. That's pretty awesome. That dog is still standing there, but... That dog is kind of scary, so we won't mess with them. Uh, oh yeah, and there's a shiny back here as well. Hmm. Well, let's go see if we can- Ow! <laughs> let's go see if we can find the ducklings for a second here. Oh! Uh, well, I think I see one. Oh my gosh. There's another shiny. <laughs> what are you even playing? Some... Oh my gosh. Look, look, look! I'm looking. What are we looking at? Only one of the greatest games of all time. Uh, how old are you to... Are you old enough to be watching this? My dad says I have to be... I have an old soul. Speaking of your dad, he asked me to come and collect you all. Uh, collect you to... for show and tell. Oh gosh. Oh no. And I gave... I gave them a female voice. Whoops. Sure. Oh, that was easy. There must be a catch. I'll go as, as, as soon as the screen stops showing things. And there it is. When will that be? No idea! I think it's looping, so it might never end. I see. But if the screen goes dark, you promise you'll come back to your dad? Duckling's honor! Okay. Is there water in this? I'm gonna just... Oh, that didn't work. Hmm. 
Okay, so we gotta clearly break it somehow. Question is how. Hmm. Yeah, these pipes seem to have something to do with it, but I'm not quite sure what. Maybe this? That seems pretty out there. But I can't jump up there, unfortunately. I don't think. No, I don't think so. Hmm. More shinies up here, by the way. There we go. Well, this seems promising. Hmm. Or not? Could have sworn this would do something. Oh, you guys, I see a red little lever and danger signs here. Yeah, we did it! There we go! <laughs> oh, oh! Are the walls supposed to be sliding around like that? Definitely not. Oh, whoa! When I blink, I can see purple shapes! Uh, I think some time away from that screen is very a very good idea. Shall we get back to your dad? Okay, I can tell him all about the new combos I saw M. Bilson do. Let's waddle! And then waddle, 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 waddle. <laughs> and we waddled away. Oh, 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 you're so cute. Oh, you're so cute. <laughs> hey, duck dad. I, I found one of your ducklings. Look at this. Ah, what a relief. Wait. This isn't the full brood. That's the sort of thing my partner tends to notice. Should I leave them here while I can search, uh, carry on the search? No! I'll help! Let me help! You can stay with the kitty as long as you promise to behave nicely. I promise. Hm. A kitty being followed by ducklings reminds me of a story I heard as a youngster. Quite the epic tale that was. You see... Psst, kitty, let's go. Yeah, I, I'm gonna agree. <laughs> gonna agree with, uh, with the little duckling here. Okay, so it seems like we have to find the other three ducklings before we kind of continue on our way. So let's go down here and see if we can find the f supposed fish that... Ooh. Hold on, there's a little hole here. Yeah, it's a hat! Let's go check out the hat. What is this? If there is a kiwi hat in this, I will never take it off, by the way. I, I have no clue what the hats are. Satsuma hat. Orange, are you glad to see this hat? Interesting. There we go. I I need a kiwi hat in, in my life for, for this kitty. But uh, we shall see if there is one. If not, then uh, I suppose we shall have to... Um, be fine with this one. Oh, there's the duckling. And here's our crow friend. Hello. And Kitty, you look like the kind of cat who enjoys a stylish accessory or two. Uh, is this a trap? Definitely not. Okay. Well, if that's uh, all, I guess I'll see you around. Unrelatedly, have you heard about my new and glorious business venture? Yeah. <laughs> it's called Shinies for Hats. You're selling hats now? Absolutely not. But it's literally called shinies for hats. Aha! That's the clever part. I'm not selling hats. I'm selling access to hats. You see, the hats live in these little pod machines. And you, a helpless kitty, do not have the secret wisdom needed to use some, the machines. Uh, let me guess, you do? But of course! Ah, uh, only I, Crow, can perform the ancient Crow ritual of inserting a token and turning the knob. Well, that doesn't sound diff- Which brings us to business. My proposition is as follows. Ten lets you get- uh, you hire one Crow, that's me, to retrieve one hat. So you are selling hats. No, 
I am a facilitator. <laughs> I'm a facilitator operating with a gig economy framework. Oh, with a business called Shines, Shinies for Hats. Yes, but only because Shinies for access to crows who have access to hats tested poorly with customers, consumers. And to use this business, I paid 10 Shinies to get a hat. You're missing the subtle economy genius of this idea. I am the hat gatekeeper. Hmm. Look, do you want a hat or not? Yes, please. Here you go. Oh, a rabbit hat. What big ears I'll have. Uh, all the better with stuff uh, to hear stuff with. Awesome. Well, we don't have money for another hat, so we'll see how that goes. But eventually we will. For now, I think I'll actually change to the bunny hat because that was adorable. We're going to wear this one. There we go. Anyhow, let's uh, let's walk in. <gasps> this is my worst nightmare. A little duckling in water. Look at me. I have a pond all to myself. Are you sure it's a pond? I'm a duck. We know about ponds. Uh, my apologies. I think it might best be time to get out of that pond, though. Your dad sent me to collect uh, collect you for show and tell. But there's still water to play in. Uh, how can you stand it? Water? It's so cold and wet and yuck. Wait, so that's, does that mean you can't collect me until I'm out of water? Uh-oh. Yay! Pond time forever! Uh, I shouldn't have... I should have seen that coming. Hmm, there must be a way to get this little one out of the water without getting wet. Hmm. Oh, but first, take a nap. Oh. Oh, this is adorable. <laughs> Are we being scanned? <laughs> oh my gosh. And a little loaf scan it is. That is awesome. Well, up we go, little kitty. We gotta... Gotta get this little duckling. Oh, Shiny. I'm not stealing, I'm just slightly borrowing for more hats. I knew it! These wind things! Oh, but there's a fish! And we gotta jump in this box. There's a fish there! How are we gonna get the fish if the wind is in front of it? There's also a bird stuck in here. Oh, okay. It ran out through the wall, I suppose. Ah, I forgot about the water. I forgot about the water. Okay, well, this is quite the tricky one. Uh, I assume this has something to do with it. Thank, for, thank you for showing me, little duckling. Hmm, maybe I could get the shopkeeper to, to clean up the water. <laughs> Oops. <gasps> yes! Okay, 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 we can just pull it out. Now I can, I can go and get my fish. No, 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 no! I need this fish! I need it! No! No! I need it! How can you do this to me? I need that fish! No! Uh, we have been bested. I want to buy a hat. A shark hat. Kitty shark to do to do to kitty shark. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we have changed. We are now a darker cat. We must. We, uh, hello? Hello? There we go. We must fend for ourselves in this world. That means. We have to go here and quickly eat it as fast 
as we can. Aha! The delicious fish has given you the energy to climb ivy. It feels so much better. I feel so much better. Let's go climb some ivy. Well, unfortunately, we can't. Goodness, run! Oh my gosh. Okay, well, you guys. We seem to see we seem to have gotten ourselves in a real pickle here. Um we shall sit and we shall think about our actions. And for now, we shall take a little break and I think the kitty needs a nap before we try this difficult challenge once again. <laughs> But with that being said, I will see you guys next episode, and I do hope you guys are enjoying this. So, until then, I'll see you guys. And I hope you have a wonderful, amazing night or day or whatever time it is for you guys. So, bye-bye.